Hello folks and welcome back. LEN function in Excel. This feature returns the length of a given text string as the number of characters in that. This feature will also count characters in numbers but the number formatting will not be considered. We'll take this example here. We have certain texts. I will remove it from here and we'll practice ourselves. This feature is equal to LEN and then we select the text string where we want to count the number of characters of that text string. We have five of them in this one and you can see there are five appearing here. In Lake Balaton, there must be more, I assume. Let's try that. 12 of them. So in this text string, we have four text characters and it is returning accordingly. Let's see what do we have here. Two of them. Perfect. And let's try it with the number. Five of them. Now, remember the fact that the number formatting will not impact, as I mentioned before. So let's remove the separator and reduce the decimal places. It is still on five. Unless you change the length of this particular cell. So the purpose of this particular function is to get the length of the text. It returns basically, as you saw here, the numbers um, of the characters in that. The syntax is, is equal to LEN and text. So the text for which you want to calculate the length, that is the text that you see in the parenthesis. So purpose of this functionality is that you can use it to see how many characters there are in some text num uh, cells. Numbers and dates are also uh, going to return a specific length. And the number formatting that is not included in that as we just saw it ourselves. So I will, I will share a small example which will demonstrate how you can uh, use this functionality within another one is equal to if and then len functionality i will give um, the text here that count the length of this particular text and if it is less than or equal to four then give me an output of right otherwise i need the output of wrong that is a functionality. Basically, uh, what, what we struggle normally is that we know a lot of features, we know a lot of functionalities of Excel, but we cannot incorporate them into our daily life. And this is one of the examples that I'm showing you how you can use this functionality, LEN, into uh, a different functionality here. We are using if function uh, to uh, determine uh, what, what is the length of this particular cell. And based on the outcome, we are going to give out a decision it's right or wrong so in this particular case if the length is less than or equal to 4 Excel should print out in cell D12 uh, an output of right and in a case if it is not less than or equal to 4 the output should be wrong so let's give it a try and let's see how it works in this case I will press enter and you can see as we had in our functionality it should demonstrate the character right let's change the length of this particular cell and now the output in d11 should be changed to wrong why because the length of this has changed so this was a demonstration of using this functionality within another functionality i hope you enjoyed folks do try it yourself add it into other functionalities and put down into the comments your experience how did you go along with that and what new thing you discovered share it with everyone i wish you all a very good day and good luck with this functionality looking forward to speak to you again bye bye